ourselves some time doing some peacekeeping in the Bosnian war and that's where Sasha is coming from another man that took the fight in the short notice Pretty cool to see Sasha Daji coming here fighting tonight from Bosnia. Uh, coming out of Drovar. This is actually uh, where I served as a peacekeeper for six months in 2001. Uh, or sorry, 2000. Very uh, cool to see. Sasha Daji from Drovar, Bosnia. Amazing, amazing. Sasha took the fight in short notice. This is a fight, it's in a heavyweight division. His opponent, the Romanian. Christian Mitria from here, Bucharest, Romania, weighing 101 kilograms, a jiu-jitsu fighter from Absoluto, Bucharest, one of the better fight, uh, gyms here in Romania, run by Tudor Mihaitza, the man that brings basically jiu-jitsu here, uh, the only black belt to my knowledge of Romanian descent, but running very successful gym uh, here in uh, Bucharest, Romania. How was your experience at Eric's F23, Will Romero? You got to fight, now you are here calling the last couple fights. How was your exper Romanian experience, the Eric's F experience? Uh, my experience has been great so far, as you can see. The Eric's F production team here has done a great, time, uh, great job. The, the management here, the whole organization doing great things here in, uh, in Romania. Beautiful country, beautiful people, beautiful show. I'm very excited. I hope they get to come back again. This has been one of my best experiences in my life. That's uh, a lot for Will Romero to say. A three-time Bellator veteran, a man that fought to have won two fights in Bellator. Not many people at high level in MMA can say that. But there you go. Uh, Will Romero making his debut at RXF 23. Coming up with the win. And uh, next fight in the heavyweight division. The hometown, Mitria versus Sasha from Bosnia and Herzegovina. Where he's coached by Tudor Mihaiza. Domnilor și domnilor, Cristian Mitre are 34 de ani, 101 kg, 1,81 m înălțime, 1,83 m alonge, a, disput, a disputat până acum 6 lute și le-a câștigat pe toate, vine din jiu-jitsu, este fost practicant de rugby. So Christian Mitria being a jiu-jitsu fighter, a black belt, coming out of Absoluto, Bucuresti. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see what game uh, plan he employs. Uh, expect for him to take it down to the ground and uh, put it where he's comfortable. Another cool fact about Mitria, he listed at one of his disciplines, rugby. Let's see if that's going to help him tonight when the fists are going to fly. Referee in charge, Catalino Celia, one of the better referees in this country. Uh, great job by him all night. Also, Georges Telian. Uh, these two guys holding it down here at Eric's F23 in Romania. And we moving into the next bout of the night in a heavyweight division. Fighters Mitria. are ready. Here we go. Fight. Touch of the gloves. Sasha in a southpaw position, starting with a low kick. Looks a little bit off balance. His hands are down. Both guys both looking like they're pretty light on their feet. Mitre is collected, looks collected. Sasha oh, rushing in with the... And Mi then he says, sorry, <laughs> I don't quite got that. Mitria doing the rugby thing right there, plowing right through him, gets him on his back. Good job with the takedown into half guard. Uh, Mitria's definitely got to keep his chin down on the stand up. Let's see how uh, he looks here. This is his uh, comfort zone. In half control, looking to slice the knee through and get mount. Passed into side. Sasha holding his neck for his life. Mitra looking to pass in full mount. Doesn't do it. Passes on the other side just to defend. Sasha needs to let that go right now. Regain guard. He's in a very, very suspect position there. He needs to let go using energy. Uh, needs to let that go and regain guard. 
Mitre taking his time, knowing that he's in a safe position. I do not quite understand why Mitre didn't secure the full mount. Working the body of Sasha right now, ferociously. He needs to really let that go and get his guard back. He's in a bad position. <coughs> Mitria should be uh, passing the, that and mounting any second now. Head it's out. There we go. Looking for the arm bar, possibly. The arm bar is about to come. Setting it up. He's got that cage there in his way. He's going to soften him up a bit. Expect that arm bar to come through now from the black belt fighting out of Romania. There we go. Takes him away from the cage. Finishes just around the corner. Mitre is taking his time here. Sasha trying to... Sasha needs to turn back into him. He's definitely in a bad position for ground and pound. He some. needs to move, covering up. This fight looks like it may be over. He is turtling up. He does not want to be there. Over. And that's all for the heavyweight bout. Mitre finishing with ground and pound. We all thought we, he's going to go for the armbar. Took his time there. Welcome. Uh, work the, the ground and pound and uh, referee Catalino Celia saw enough. Uh, looked like uh, Sasha got opened up a little bit on his lips. Paula, Good. the cut man, coming in to attend him. Good finish uh, by Mitria. Uh, he was setting up the armbar. Uh, he looked for his other options. He saw that it wasn't there, had that armbar secured. Uh, couldn't throw the leg over because of the cage and uh, decided to just keep the position and finish with the ground and pound. Sasha definitely uh, out of position, um, not very experienced in the ground as you can see, so uh, Mitra took uh, full advantage and got the W. Quick finish, good showing. Always exciting to see the heavyweights, man. Those guys can finish the fight at any time, power. Yeah, these guys are heavy hitters. I mean, uh, Sasha in the bottom position there as you can see, just uh, felt the power, needed to uh, roll into him to avoid the armbar, avoid that... Uh, uh, back uh, control and um, he just put himself in a bad position and was not able to uh, get himself out. Great stoppage by the referee. <laughs> See, Sasha didn't look like he uh, was going to get out of this position. Just getting punished. Mitri had choose to not go for the submission coming from Jiu Jitsu background. Uh, took his time and uh, ground and pound him. Uh, if you wish to submission Sasha. Good on him, uh, being a black belt. He could have, uh, you know, went for the armbar possibly uh, if he waited a little longer. But uh, why not uh, go for the knockout? Good, good job. Would be nice to see him uh, take on someone a little bit tougher. But uh, great for uh, uh, Sasha to jump in and take the fight. Um, would be definitely be good to see Mitra take on someone uh, a little tougher. Uh, good job on him. Did what he had to do. You can never blame the guy. Done. Konecki Dunn, supposed to be his initial opponent. Uh, Konecki, same like calling, decided in the last moment, but he's not going to show up. He's not going to fight. Good thing we're here in uh, Eastern Europe, uh, Romania. Many, many tough fighters in the surrounding areas. There's no shortage of guys willing to step up and uh Ladies fight and so good 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 on sasha but uh Your needs some work to do for sure in the first round by tko donelor shidonilor un vingator in prima runda prin tko un colzul roshu christian mitra romania and in the referee catalina making it all official